Hey guys, what is going on? This is Fritz, and this is another really cool tutorial. I haven't seen it done at all before. Um, it is basically the plus 500 kind of like shatter, I guess, but it doesn't disappear, which is why I really like it. It'd be really cool to have kind of like in a repetitive feed, like boom, 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 and with the thing coming out. And there is CC on it right now, which is why it looks somewhat shiny, and so we're just going to turn that off right now. And you can see there, it's pretty plain now. Um, you can do stuff like you can add glow to make it pretty, but I just like to CC it worked out great so I'm gonna teach you how to do this effect right now because I'm a nice guy so let me just get rid of the adjustment layer the black bars and this so all I've done here was Twixter where the plus 500 comes in so right there so do that on your own I don't want to waste time in the tutorial on that it's pretty straightforward uh, there's nothing special about it so now what we want to do is uh, make the text for the plus 500 so we're gonna go to composition new composition just hit OK and what we want to do is right click new solid object just the black ones fine for now and now we're gonna add text on this we're just gonna click here and type in plus 500 and now it doesn't have to be exactly in the right spot but it has to be pretty well on it so right about there is where I'm guessing it's going to be and we can actually turn off the black solid for now we don't need to see it and if we go to our five man clip here with the clip is and the plus 500 and we drag the composition that we made just put the text on you can see there it is it pops up so we need to fix it a little bit so it looks a little bit nicer um, we'll try right there maybe is that on it maybe down a little bit it doesn't have to be perfect but it has to be close so that's close enough for me I can live with that one now what we want to do is look up well we have to sync it first so it comes out in the right spot so right right there that's where it ends get rid of that first part now what we want to do is look for an effect called CC pixel poly Dra drag it on there and we need to make sure the beginning of the uh, composition so there you can see how it's not the beginning it's not like split the beginning is at the start otherwise it won't work so we're just going to line it up perfectly and then you can see here it already does a pretty nice little uh, little uh, like drop it's all pretty automatic but it's cool what I do though is I make my speed 100 and it kind of shoots it out a little bit nicer and it's faster so there's that um, also what I did is I made the direction randomness a little higher so that way it kind of has more of a more oomph to the uh, shot so now what we want to do is make a couple more of these little uh, things I guess I don't really know what to call them so we're just gonna go to grid spacing and we can like bring it down so it's a lot or we can just kind of leave it like here I believe the number I used was 7 because that's a pretty good number and you can see there it just goes like whoosh and it collides and it's really cool with a nice CC. So now let's say you want to make it look a little nicer you can go and add star glow to it. I spelled it wrong. Star glow. Star glow. Just like that. And if you put that on it kind of makes some shine a little bit and it's kind of cool. Or if you just want to add some plain old glow this comes with After Effects. Just throw it on there and then you can see they glow already without even CC and it's very nice so that's the that's the effect guys it's really straightforward um, if there's something you don't get just rewatch the video I think I did a good job of explaining it um, so leave a like down below uh, leave a comment down below and subscribe if you're new I make editing tutorials and I edit for I edit Call of Duty videos so I'm Fritz I'm out peace